Good morning. Good evening. Good afternoon. Jane, stop lying to us. Alright, let's go fight some Heartless. I don't know something. This introduction is actually very fitting for this game. Uh, why? Morning, evening, afternoon. Do you leave at dawn? Do you leave at midday? Or do you leave at late evening? Uh, I don't think here's the thing. Heartless! Then I really want to figure out what that show was I used to watch. It was... It's actually you think of Men in Black as a show, except it only deal with aliens, they just deal with everything supernatural. Was it Torchwood? I don't think so, because it was set in Chicago. Uh... I don't know. Because I just vaguely remember it, considering that's actually why I remember Sphinxes so much nowadays, simply because one of the recurring characters was a Sphinx at a uh, library in Chicago, and they would actually just go to it for information, and they would always have to like, try to come up with a new riddle for it, because it got tired of people knowing the answer to its original one. I have four legs at dusk and three legs at dawn. Heavy as lead, yet float like a swan. What am I? Oh, they changed colors. Interesting. Oh, were they not the color? They're sure they were blue. Oh. But the... the Actually, the, these are the colors the bouncies were originally. I think... And, and I think I have seen pink. them. Yeah, they're pink now. Thank you, monkey. Monkey. <laughs> One thing I wish they did is if you kill stuff and like gain experience in uh in and then you die, you got to keep it. Like if you just choose to respawn. Fire! That too much. Yeah, but I don't think the monkeys are weak to ice. Not weak to fire either, it takes two fireballs to draw all the fires. Okay, get him, boys! Get him, boys! I don't know why I was just finding the, the uh, wilds interesting. I guess it's more so maybe because you could actually just replace the heartless face with a mask and they could just be a completely different design for something. Yeah? Oh. That was, I think, oddly enough. Okay, wait one Far right, right? Yep. I'm really nervous that it's gonna kill us if we get it wrong. Because it does lightning bolt you. Because this can get us thunder gems. I think it's better. Trust you. Yes, trust is rewarded. You can occasionally get a thunder or lightning stone or something from them before the end. Oh, we can ball Pikachu. you. Sorry, what? Ooh. We don't have enough. That was the thing that I just made. That was the Um, yeah. So it, for how I do it is if I get any kind of item drop from them, I just walk right the hell out. Clearing out the monkeys! Yeah, what was the about them? Oh yeah, they're Fire. also technically one of the few heartless that actually have like a Fire. personality type. This is first game. Yeah. Oh, don't trip. Don't trip, watch out for slingshots. No, that's good. No, they have slingshots. Okay. Yeah, these are bounces. Uh, are you sure not thinking of the one, like, the sniper one? That you find in battle? Because these ones drop bananas and they do money. Yeah. Fire. They have slingshots? I could have sworn about you once that just, yeah. Okay. Because they don't really attack you. Because they're, they're, there's another type of monkey heartless that uh, that do have slingshots. They like snipe you and you have to kill them without being seen. They're an endgame one, though. Right, where do I go from here? I don't remember the jungle very well. <gasps> Ooh. Nope. Okay. Bye. What? What is that? What? 
What is the cannon? Fire. It's not fire. It's not wizard. Oh, yeah. that makes sense. What? They're actually a completely new one that's only specifically for the final mixes. Yeah, okay. Okay, so when they shiver, you got a flame in the fire. Well, I screwed that up. It's all learning screens. Okay, so when they shiver, light them up with fire. We got literally nothing. Maybe the bamboo thing again? Because this is not a very large world. None of the world are that large. Because I remember we had to go back to the higher canopy at some point. Oh, I think we have to do that now. Well, we murdered. That's enough. Yep, so we switched up our list of interesting game called Sniper Wild. I guess, yeah, even look at the original science of Bounty and Power, they did have the yeah, SN shots. Oh! That's a sassy monkey. Monkey! Uh, Actually, that's very interesting. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, I said monkey, I remember. Just like I designed. Oh, yeah, Fang from Dave the Barbarian. Thinking quickly, Dave makes a megaphone using nothing but a squirrel, a piece of string, and, and a megaphone. megaphone. God, I missed that show. <laughs> oh my god, it's so dumb, but I love that. It was dumb in a smart way. Hippo, don't eat me. Hippos are, like, freaking deadly. <laughs> Which is very weird, considering we don't really portray them that way immediately very often. Yeah, but, like, because they, they're big, and he here's the thing. Big carnivores are actually less dangerous than big herbivores. You know why? I appreciate sure big herbivores are always going to be bigger than any big large carnivore. Well, no, but even if you have two of the same size, you don't want to mess with an herbivore more than you don't want to mess with a carnivore. Because a carnivore relies on hunting stuff down. So if it gets injured, it's not going to get food, it's going to die. An herbivore usually comes as part of a herd, and in addition to that, if they get injured, Fire. well, they can still graze. So, herbivores tend to be much more belligerent than carnivores. Fair enough. And then there's the hyena. Don't fuck with the hyena. Or a honey badger. Arrow G. Hyena moms are weird, Fire. like the alpha moms. Fire. Well, hyenas in general are just weird. Yeah, but I find the alpha moms. I will not go into details why. You can Google that for yourself. If you're watching this, I'm sure you would already know. <laughs> More monkeys. What was it? John Green who occasionally talked about giraffe reproduction? No, that's not about right. Ow. I should have used a potion. I was gonna say, like, I can use a potion, I've got plenty, and then I die. Now we run it. Eh, didn't need that much time. We're not in a speed run. But it's taking a while to load. There we go. Wee, wee, wee. Man, okay. Y you know what's one of the things about Sora that I don't get? What? How the hell does he have so much upper body strength? You, you know how he, like, flips? when he goes up a ledge. I just always assumed that she was a full helium. That, that would not be enough. Get in here, boys. Thanks. Where does Sora take the start in the story? That's a challenge. I more so mean BTC of a comic Oh. Get the butt kicked by Riku. I'm fine. I'm really done. Because he's a, he's a kid on Destiny Island. True, but he's actually a competent kid when we actually look at his room. Yeah, I guess that's fair. I mean, he has sons fishing women and harpoons. Yeah, also his parents. His what now? We hear them in this game. <laughs> nah, Sora just exists. The Virgin Sora. I mean, Dengue gets more than Riku. What? 
I was healing! Does he, though? We learn nothing of Riku's family or lineage. Oh, I thought you meant in the temple of love life. Not, not parentage. Uh, let's think about that. Do we want to? Well, there are answers. I think the most prominent one I know of is technically nominate. Ooh, I know. See ya. She is one of those other weird, inexplicable things like your hearts. Okay. See ya. She's Kyrie's nobody. Oh. Who is blonde for some reason and barely looks like her. Okay, being different hair color isn't that weird, but not with the same Yep, different hair color, different eye color. Would you? Different powers. Kyrie has powers? Technically, yes. Ah! I mean, hell, technically, Kyrie has more right to build a keyblade than Sora does. Really? Yep. Oh, yeah, because Sora was picked by accident. Well, that's... We're going for Riku. Oh, right, Kingdom Hearts 1, so you might know the weird story of Birth by Sleep. Uh. Uh. Yes. Can I explain? Uh, basically, there is actually a little ceremony thing you can do to essentially pass on the right to wield the Keyblade. Okay. Someone did that to Riku, someone did that for Kairi, no one did that for Sora. Sora just got lucky that Ventus ended up in his heart. Who? Ventus. Who? Roxas. Okay. Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, it's another one of those weird things in Kingdom Hearts where... Alright, why is Sora's nobody okay, yeah. look so different than him? Yeah. You saw that flip, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. The upper body strength, my god. You gotta be the power of Keyblade. You can do that in Destiny Island before you get a Keyblade. Uh, not sure who gets entering Ventus. <sighs> He's always in Sora's heart. <laughs> was he just born there? Or was Sora born with it in there? Uh, no, technically Ventus is like 5,000 years old. No, but was Sora born with Ventus in his butt heart? Uh, no, he got Ventus in his heart about five years ago. What? Kingdom Hearts, ladies and gentlemen. What? I'm glad I brought you along now. Because, well, I, that, yeah, I waited for you to record more because what the hell? You see, in the beginning, there was one world. <laughs> then the darkness showed up. Okay. Then everything got split into multiple worlds. And then there was a town called Daybreak Town. It is the home of the Keyblade Wolves, or at least it was. Because for some reason, the Master of all Keyblade Wolves decided, Hey, you know what? We're gonna start a war. Why? Did he have any reason? Uh, he wanted to see the future. Just wait, dude! Yeah, so he fucked up his eye and put it into Keyblade. The hell? I was saying it makes more sense to this, but only barely. Especially considering he made a book of prophecy that actually held the future. It wasn't accurate? Only as accurate as far as I saw. Okay. Oh, I don't care. I'm, I'm leaving. Fire. See ya. Just in case. Far right. Initially. Far right. Oh! Nope, we screwed up. Bye, 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 bye. Is it? No, it's not. I do like that unconscious move. It's pretty nice. Stun attack? I think so, yeah. Now we have the bounties. Then there go the bounties. So much money. Over a hundred bucks for me. Want to get rid of jackpots? Take charge. What jackpot do again? More money and crap. How do we even use money in this game? You, you buy crap. Don't remember doing that that often. Eh, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll buy stuff eventually. We say that, then we just follow the traditional RPG standards. We'll buy it eventually. Hey, and I spent a cent. I bought gear for the boys already, and that's like the only place you get most of their gear. Like, eventually we'll have quests and stuff for that, but that's really where you get most of the gear up there, so we'll, we'll, we'll do it. I honestly think the Outer Worlds is the only game where I've actually actively spent money. 
Mainly because I actually make it very good about that. That's good. Even though I don't really need it. <laughs> 7,000 rounds for my sniper rifle. That's a lot of bullet. Yep. Yeah, every time I go into the shop, I buy out their stock because they refresh. Fair enough. <gasps> Clayton's butt plug! Some more. Dodging. I do like how you just kind of fire. fire. Yep, and then they change the theme hearts too. Fire. Remember, it's a satellite move. Fire. It just spins around you. Oh, I don't that at all. I died. I should be killed. It, it orbits you? Yeah, if you uh, hold the blade up and fireballs just spin around you. Huh. I guess it was too overpowered in this game. Because apparently magic is the most powerful build in the end game. Because uh, in Kingdom Hearts 1, your damage is based on how much MP you have. In Kingdom Hearts 2 and beyond, they just give you a magic stat. Yeah, yeah, Clayton's butt plug. And then, of course, there's the most beautiful thing they introduce in Kingdom Hearts 3. Something you hardly ever see in an RPG. What? Water magic. Does ooze magic count as water magic to you? Fire! I guess it depends on what the constitution of the ooze is. Uh, this is enough to have sex with. Fire! I got that slime magic, which is something. Well, I mean, it's not a slime magic. But yeah, I get it. Get him, boys! Get him, boys! Get her! Fire! What was interesting in the things? Out of all these games, we finally have water magic. Keep getting her. I'm, I'm not. Gonna, uh, there we go. Okay, that was a waste of a potion, but whatever. It's never a waste of a potion. Here. Oh, I smoke too much weed, man. <laughs> Now Tarzan has a new pimp code. <laughs> and we tear her fang out. And she's not needing it. I think she's still alive. I don't think she wants to be. She just got bludgeoned death by a key. Why aren't the monkeys doing anything? Monkey. They're, they're the, the heartless monks. I think they're doing something. I think they're going to do something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I get Ooh. That's right, I guess Jane's dad's not in this game. Does she have a dad in the movie? Yeah. Oh, okay. I really want to equip the white thing. <gasps> you. Get cold. Get cold. Get cold. Cold yet? I love it. This one's not doing anything, but the other one in the corner is. That 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 thing. The key. Ah! <laughs> Goofy! Goofy! That's gravity. I think. We don't have. Uh, no, I think that one was sealed because gravity is when it starts floating. Oh, okay. But either way, we don't have it. Nope, that was Blizzard. Yep. Praying is poison. Okay, we just missed a fire. See ya. Yes. I think you actually get a bonus reward if you do all the same. Fire. But we did get a blaze shard, so I'm okay with this. We got fragment of blaze cat. Deep freeze. I saw about two seconds ago we saw this place that's full of See monkeys down in the mushrooms. Back to the treehouse. I think I think this is the one level with a ton of needless backtracking. Yeah, because well, it's such a tiny world, there's not much to do in it. But not the smallest world. The smallest world. Full of the Coliseum. It gets bigger in Kingdom Hearts too. Yes, but in this in this game it's 
what, two, or two rooms? And the arena. Yeah. Get over here! Really, Olympus Coliseum is the one world that has the biggest blow up. It's literally in every game it appears after one, it just gets bigger. Yeah. Considering one, it's just two rooms. Two, it's two rooms in the other way. Not three. Is it by wait, 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 it's not in three? No, it is in three, but I'm remembering the game comes before three. Oh, okay. Because I believe it is also in Dream, not Dream Top Distance. Why well, it might be dropped? That's also the other weird thing. A little bit game that's appeared in that the once appeared in most games. What about Traverse Town? Is that in two? Nope, Traverse Town doesn't appear again yeah. until Dream Top Distance. Uh, Hollow Bastion. Hollow Bastion is in one, two. Yeah, that's it. Oh, God. Oh, wait, I guess also Chain of Memories. So one Chain of Memories in two because. Oh, oh, wow. In three, it's in a cutscene. I'm sorry. The big black fruit looks suspicious. Way to be racist and homophobic, game. Oh, that is sissy. <laughs> Hey, a power shard. What was I saying? It is birth by sleep where it appears and actually has the grease. Grease? Yeah. What, what, Fire! Like grease. Grease. The movie Grease. Fire! Grease, the place that would become Rome. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry. I was thinking... <laughs> Guys, I'm 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 not tired. I'm not high. I'm just dumb. I'm the one that's tired. I still remember that at least. Yes, the first I see, they introduce a bit of grease, and then for Kingdom Hearts 3, we get actually not for Kingdom Hearts 3, we don't get the underworld, but we get a love it's itself. Oh, that's cool. Do I have to do magic on the fruit, or can I just? Do I have to do magic on the fruit, or can I just? I remember just hitting it. I remember it takes a long time, but you can't just hit it. Oh, how well I have to deal with it. Oh, yeah, I guess, technically speaking, a little small seam is the one world that's taken the longest time to actually get through its <laughs> connected movie. Fair enough. Considering it wasn't until 3 that we even get the climax of the movie with them fighting Titans. We fight the Titans in this game, just in the Coliseum. Not sure if I fight the Ice Titan. No, you fight, uh, at the end of the Hades Cup, you fight the uh, Rock Titan, too. Yeah. So, two of them. And then three, we get all the Titans, as well as the actual scene from the movie of them capturing Zeus. And then along came Zeus, he hurled his thunderbolts, he zapped. And so it was one of the weirdest things. Zeus, the big hero, Hades, the villain. When a lot of times, it's actually the exact opposite. Yeah. And then Poseidon was not mentioned at all. Yeah. Oh my god, you're right. Alright, so we can jump straight from the treehouse to the boss fight with Clayton, so I'm gonna go to go over here and save him. I'm also gonna, I'm also... Because we will get more eventually. I just exchanged that potion for another potion. Eventually. And, you know what? And after this, we get cured. So, we won't need potions as much. Um, but, yeah. We are going to probably need the Mega Potions. Because, for those of you who don't know, I'll... Any of you? I don't know. Um, for those of you who don't know, Mega Potions are a potion, but it applies to the whole party. I guess if you take the fence, you get blocked, considering... Again, I don't remember boss fights being that hard, though, again, I play very defensively. I feel like Clayton's hard to know. He's just... Cause the, I mean, Clayton's not hard. The chameleon that's hard. Yeah, because I just remember blocking a lot of chameleon's hits. Ignore them, boys. Whee! To hell! Uh, we got five minutes. Think we can beat this thing, Josh? Yeah, we try. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Why'd you all come here, monkeys? They want to round it up. By yeah, okay, that's fine.
Why'd you stop, Clayton? You don't give a crap about us. It's just kind of one of those instinctual things. You hear someone yell, you kind of look. Well, you can just look full the trigger. No! He's a bitch. He looks like a Clayton. He looks like he's made of clay. Clayton? Not Clayton. Get him, boys. <laughs> Not Clayton. That was a waste. <laughs> I I can play that, but I can't do it. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, you know what? Uh, don't, don't play that. I really don't have to do that. <laughs> Guys! Play it! Monkey, anyone? <laughs> Somebody! Shoot me! There we go! I forgot to give the boys items, because that's actually useful. That's something. Oh, don't drop me right there. I don't want to die again. Yeah, yeah, okay. Holy crap, Goofy has a lot of shit. Should I use high potions? What's Elixir do? Uh, that's a full heal. Complete full heal. I'm not using them right now. Especially because Elixirs, I don't think you can buy. Like, high potions, I don't think we can buy them yet, but we can buy them. Okay. We saw this already. Focus on Clayton. Did I equip the fang? I don't think you did. Okay, that's something to do if I die. Because... Uh, how do you... Uh, 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 just there if we don't see him. Uh, 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 Get him, Dom. Yeah, it's over, get him. Uh, yeah, we got him. Alright, boss fight's over. Good job, Josh. Hey. Oh, maybe the boss fight's not over. Oh, uh, great. It's time to come around Verde. And Tarzan's dead. Let's just start dodging right off the bat. Oh, I could have left before? Maybe? That really just changed the portions of the arena. Oh, I... Dang it! All three of us! Do not heal, Clayton. You do not get to heal, Clayton. There's the boss. I don't try to see him. Actually, I don't try to scan him. I know something. I don't think we actually see the chameleon in the thing over here. Is it in pain? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, there's this one. Yeah, because we see the horse, we see Flynn. Yeah, they don't see At least not to my knowledge of memory. Great Potato wasn't my favorite one in that game. It's a good move. Dump that back and we still have actual villains in Disney movies. Um, yeah, because we had Mother Gothel and the, the bitches. Yeah. It's such a shame that that's a statement. He's What the hell? Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Uh, but yeah, what was the movie? Uh, 
that don't have villains. Uh, so that material they're turning to red is one. Though at least that one technically has something a bit closer to a villain. Uh, what's the other this movie? He's got bullies. Uh, no, technically the big bass mother. Oh, Clayton, you better not have healed. If you healed, I will kill you. I love <laughs> That's kind of another one where the matriarchal figure. Oh my uh, god! Stop healing, please. I don't remember that weird dragon, buddy. Uh, onward? American Dragon Jake Long? Uh, no, there was a movie that came out more or less fairly recently that no one paid attention to. Onward, I remember him about that one. I'm pretty sure that one also doesn't have villains. It does not. It's fine, though. Uh, two. That had it on. Oh, it did. What just happened? Did you see the screen go splur? Like it, 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 it. Okay. We did a pretty good job. We did not succeed. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take a break. Uh, I'm gonna equip items. Then I'm gonna save. Then I'm gonna take a break. Then we're gonna end the episode. We're gonna end the episode first. See you guys later. Did it.